I never imagined I'd say this, but I think Iran's hostility to Israel can be summed up by the experience of a single Iranian wrestler named Ali Reza. A few days ago, Ali Reza was about to beat a Russian wrestler in a world championship, and then his coach ordered him to lose the match. The reason? Because in the next round, Ali Reza would have had to face an Israeli wrestler. You see, Iran forbids its athletes from competing against Israelis. Now, that's not surprising, given that the regime in Tehran calls for the destruction of all Israelis, the destruction of Israel. Now, that's not going to happen, I assure you. We won't let that happen. But in the meantime, it's the people of Iran who pay the price. When his coach told Ali Reza to throw the match, he said his whole world seemed to come to an end. Just imagine a government forbidding its athletes from competing against blacks, gays, or Arabs. Close your eyes and think about Ali Reza for a moment. He trained countless hours. He dreamed of becoming a world champion. But the Iranian regime would rather see its athletes lose than compete against Israelis. So I have an idea. This is an idea that will honor and inspire future Ali Reza's by promoting exactly the kind of coexistence and tolerance that Iran tries so hard to stamp out. I want you to film yourself playing a sport against someone of a different nationality, a different faith, or different color. I want you to compete like hell. We're all for competition. Then I want you to shake hands, go out for a drink together, and then upload this to the social media. I want you to show Iran's regime that hating others will never make you a champion. It only makes you a pathetic and insecure loser. Winners aren't afraid to show tolerance and respect. Ali Reza, I want you to know that the tyrants who made you take a fall will fall themselves. A regime that crushes the creative and competitive spirits of its people, that regime is doomed. So are those who threaten to destroy the Jewish state. They'll go down for the count.